Happy Monday. We have Penny and Barrett's F1 Shoe Doodle Puppies, and these babies are four weeks old now. So they're walking around, and their eyes are open, and they're growing, and at the most fun stage. So we're gonna look at each of the babies today, and then we're gonna fix them their puppy food and let them eat. And they'll be a really big mess usually once they eat. That's when we start our puppy call, and we'll continue the puppy call every time we feed the pups. So we do have availability in this litter. If you're interested in one of these puppies, you can email us at okoyriverdoodles at gmail.com and we'll schedule a phone call and answer any questions you might have. These puppies will be ready to go home the end of October. They'll be eight weeks old then. And at six weeks old, we'll take them to the vet and we'll have their first set of vaccinations done. They'll be microchip before they go home and just exciting times for the puppies. Probably in the next couple of weeks, probably not next week, but the week after, we'll be taking new pictures of them and we'll do individual videos of each of the puppies. And then of course they'll have their movie Monday, every Monday. All right, we've got some adventuring puppies coming out. So this little black and white puppy is Honey Crisp. She's got that dot on her head. Her eyeliner is coming in around her eyes and she's just a pretty little puppy. We have Granny Smith right here. She's one of our Merle females. And it looks like Granny Smith may very well have two blue eyes. We'll keep watching their eyes as they grow. We have Rome right here. He's a Merle boy. And so he um, has these fun markings on his tail. And we've got Macintosh. He's the biggest puppy in the litter. He's one of our black and white boys. They start wrestling and they're coming in slow motion. They're so fun to watch at this age. Okay, we may have some puppies still sleeping. We have Sugar Bee right here. Sugar Bee looks like she may have blue eyes also. She's the smallest puppy in the litter. Uh, she's a merle female. We have Fuji next. He's got some brown markings on him. Uh, he's a Merle boy. He's the only Merle boy in the litter. And then we have Cameo. She's a Merle female. It's kind of hard to say Merle girl. It rhymes and Sounds funny when I say it. Here's Cameo. And we have John of Gold. She's still got bed hair. She's a sleepy puppy. A black and white girl. And then we have Pink Lady. And she's a black and white girl. The double eye patches and she has some brown markings. And then we have Ambrosia. And she's a merle female. She's got a lot of color to her. So these puppies are F1s. Mom is Penny, she's an old English sheepdog. And dad is Barrett, he's a poodle. So these puppies are 50% Old English Sheepdog and 50% Poodle. They're gonna have loaded on shedding, wavy coats. Some of them big waves or big curls, not tight poodle curls. And Penny's about 60 pounds and Barrett's about 35. So most of their puppies have been between the sizes of mom and dad. Girls are most often 40 to 50 pounds and the boys are 45 to 55. But it's possible they could stay a little smaller or get a little bigger. So we're going to go ahead and mix up their puppy food and then we're gonna bring it and let these babies eat. They may not know what's happening quite at first. We may have to, I mean, Crisp is climbing in my lap. We may have to 
show them about the food and where the food is at first, but it won't be long before we do the puppy call and they come running. There's Fuji. And Roan's playing with Ryder. Granny Smith's checking out the couch. And this is our apple of my eye litter, so they all have apple names. But when we talk to the puppy, we just call them puppy. We don't call them by their apple names. <laughs> we just brought a dog in and that woke everybody up. So you can see them playing and moving now. And then we'll mix up their food. Well, Silver Ambrosia is still asleep. Oh, they're little puppy sounds. Oh, Ambrosia woke up too. So now everybody's up and awake. Which is good. They'll be really excited when we bring their food in. So we're going to go mix that up now. And then we'll let you watch them eat before movie Monday's over. Okay, we have the puppy's food fixed, and we're going to put it down for them and do the puppy call. And then let the puppy start eating. So their puppy food's a mixture of baby rice cereal, goat's milk, uh, probiotics, NuVet, vitamins or supplement and some canned uh, starter puppy food. Alright, yeah, you can put it down. Puppies, puppies, puppies! Alright, and they don't know what that means yet. <laughs> but they're gonna figure out pretty quickly. We'll put the puppies around it. And a lot of times they start crawling through it and making big huge messes. So, it may happen. By the time the puppies go home at eight weeks, they'll be eating just dry kibble. We feed the TLC whole life formula, but they start on this puppy puppy food that we fix for them and eat that for a little while. The more the puppies eat, the less Penny will feed them and it starts the weaning process. So she'll still spend time with them, but start feeding them less as we start feeding them and they eat puppy food. And they usually are very excited about puppy food. And I think they're all pretty happy about this. So we hope you check back in next week with our sheepadoodle -doodle puppies and see how these puppies grow here at Okoy River Doodles.